channel his own gringo loco gringo loco comes here every opportunity we give him he slam dunks it i don't think he spent a single moment at this company without a championship around his waist alex shelley been trying to you know get his gringo loco going on and he's been failing big time so maybe here tonight he can prove why he is one of the longest running competitors in this business today and one of the most influential out there Maybe, uh, maybe get some gold finally here at Demand Lucha. Gringo Loco, certainly one of the top stars in professional wrestling today, traveling all over the globe. Not to take anything away from Gringo Loco, he won the Premier Championship in his debut night here at Demand Lucha. Yeah, darn he had nice. historic reigns, he had historic defenses, but you're in there against the Motor City Machine Guns, two former world heavyweight champions of professional wrestling. Yeah, darn right. Both of them have held that TNA Impact Heavyweight title. And not only that title. Here, we got the lights back. But the list of titles goes on and on and on. It's Alex Shelley. It's Chris Sabin. Oh, yeah, all over the world. New Japan, all over the Indies. But, hey, I got to tell you, as a promoter, 
You know, first of all, never meet your heroes. They always let you down. Secondly, you can't be a mark. You can't be, uh, get stars in your eyes over the guys that you're booking. But personally, dude, I am a huge Chris Saban stan. I'm a big Chris Saban mark, and I am hyped that it's been almost 13, or 14. Dude, since 2014, it has been 10 years since we've had Chris Saban in our ring. Maybe 2015, but a hell you of a long time. You have to give credit where it's due. And not only Chris Saban, 10 years since he's been here at Demand Lucha, but he goes all the way back to the beginning. Oh, at yeah. BSE, all at Square Circle Wrestling. I think the last time was Ricochet, 20, 2014. It's been a long time. And then Alex Shelley came in, been working, but never have we had them both here at the same time. This is awesome. A dream come true. Certainly an indie dream match here. Los Desperados, two of the top high flyers. I'm sure Motor City Machine Gun see a lot of themselves in the younger Gringo Loco and Arez. And you never know what to expect with Arez. Now, I'm sure it's a dream match for them as well, but maybe they'll be on Dream Street. I mean, the Motor City Machine Guns know what they're doing. Look, Ty and Erez in knots. This is an Erez move here, going through the ropes, hammer locking your opponent, and there's that deadly butt chop. The King of Strange Style. There, Saban, a little more damage. Have you seen the King of Strange Style looking so nice? Look at that gear he's got. I know you didn't want to talk about the gear, but I mean, usually he's like, a wild man, a madman. I'm a gear whore, it's true. And now he's got matching gear with Gringo Loco, Los Desperados. Like me and Lindsay Dorado, all we do is talk about gear. And we just gave away that charitable gear for sick kids, Lindsay Dorado, that live auction. Alex Shelley tying the King of Strange Style up here. Unusual, but was able to break that hold in the side headlock, Hutch Henrys. You're at a bit of a loss for words here in this main event. I'm kind of paying attention. There we go. Wow, hard slam to the canvas. Really, have I not been talking or something? What the hell? No, but we're watching on here in anticipation. We could see new tag team champions here tonight. And Motor City Machine Guns have held tag team gold wherever they've gone. And I'm sure they'd like to add one more to their long list. Those brand new, newly minted Demand Lucha yeah, World man. Canadian oh, Tag Championship. Look at this, here we go, India Deathlock. Went about it a weird way, but he's got it in deep, and look at Shelly writhing in pain. And since he's from Mexico City, it's an Indian Deathlock. Would it be like an Aztec, an Aztecan Deathlock? Aztecian? A Mayan Deathlock? Like, I've learned not to argue with you, Chris. I'm gonna go with yes. Alex Shelly, wasn't expecting that. It's hard to prepare for someone like RS. It's true. I'm actually a little distracted by this dude in the gray hat with the beard over there. Like, he tried to put his hand out to get a high five from Gringo, Gringo Loco on the entrance, and Gringo didn't see. And then he, like, he got really mad. He started giving him the finger. He's been yelling at Gringo Loco the whole time here just because he didn't get a high five. And what's going on? Alex Shelley kissing the boots? Oh, oh that's, giving more him the like, that's more like Alex Shelley right there, isn't yeah. it? Everybody's got attitude here tonight. The fans, how does the it, wrestlers. How is it someone like Chris Saban? He looks like he reverses with age. He looks younger now it's amazing, than what he did. I don't even understand it. And like, he's honestly, he's it's so It's like Benjamin cool. Button right now in the squared circle. It's like, weirdly, he still has like, he's got like the 90s haircut. Like, he, he, he could look like a nerd, but the truth is he's actually like the coolest dude around. He's in great shape, boyish charm. Oh, Toronto in support of Gringo Loco, and I can't say that it's not deserved, Hutch Henrys, with the performances that he's given time and time again. Well, you called it, Chris. I don't think that kind of stuff is gonna face someone the caliber of Chris Saban. Hail Saban, they used to say. Hail Saban. the Gringo logo hail Saban, Hutch Henrys? If he does it right now, he might by the end of the match. Another wrist lock here from the former champ. And when Chris Saban was the champion at Impact, he got an endorsement from the Hulkster brother. Bre brother, brother. Oh, all the way over. Gringo Loco, too quick. The base guy. How about that for cartwheels? Handstand for Gringo Loco. Takes a lot to impress Chris Saban, but he looks impressed. I have to say I'm a little bit ill-prepared. I didn't do my homework. I didn't look to see if Gringo Loco had ever faced Shelly or Chris Saban. I know I was talking to Gringo Loco when he got to the building. He said that they had never faced each other in tag team action before. 
And that would make sense because Los Desperados are a fairly new unit, fairly new faction in the sport of professional wrestling. Travel together, work against each other, traveled all over, but now oh, aligned, yeah. and now with Tag Team Gold. Sometimes your enemies can become your best friends over time. Well, isn't that happened with Shelly and Saban as well? Probably. I'm sure they've had their ups and downs over the years. Two pioneers of the X Division. Trademark Motor City Machine Guns. They've done it all, they've seen it all. And now standing tall. Alex Shelley still has that attitude every time he comes here to Toronto. Gringo Loco, he swears a blue streak, but at least he calls us his people. Alex Shelley, he's insulted Toronto many, many times of when he course, comes here. Of course, these guys have the pride, go. the pride of Detroit, the pride of the Motor City. A long storied rivalry, not just in professional wrestling, but in hockey. Yeah, yeah, I mean, one of those few cities that's really close here to Toronto, Canadian border, Detroit, New York. There are a handful of cities that have their Canadian rivalries, that's for sure. Absolutely, the original six, and we're seeing that pan out right here. It's down to these four men in the main event of Boom Shaka Lucha. That's why we got Brad Myers in there, this senior official this evening. Gringo Loco to the buckles at the hands of Alex Shelley who just measures the base god, Hutch Henrys. You know, it was pretty cool most of the night, but once the last two matches came out... Yeah, it is getting hot it's in getting here right hot. now. Side headlock from Alex Shelley. Didn't see the blind tag to Ares, ducking under. Bam, rounds right into it, Chris. Smarting from that one. And here we go, roll through, pop up. Wham, big neck breaker. Great innovation there from Los Desperados, almost like a heart attack into a sling blade. Great positioning. Oh boy, this is gonna be dirty. Side of the head perhaps. No, oh. back of the head, flipping. Leg drop to the back. How about that for Tag Continuity on the Motor City Machine Guns? It was enough to bring Saban back into the ring. Uh, he ran right into a boot though. Los Desperados in firm control here, opposite side with Saban. Gringo all the way up, gonna spike him down. Wham, flapjack. Standing moonsault. Great power there from Gringo Loco, that military pressing Saban. And the tag champs, the Royal Canadian Tag Team Champs, showing us why they hold that gold. Fans to their feet here for Los Desperados. Yeah, classic rabbit kicks there from Arez, getting the fans hyped up. Now shushing them. Oh! Overhand chop delivers on Alex Shelley. I've had louder. Oh, the devastating butt chop. That's uh, called a receipt, isn't it, Hutch Henrys? Uh, yeah, you know what, I guess you're right. Some dirty shot side of the head here. Big time mistake though, Hutch Henry's from Arez. He inadvertently had driven Alex Shelley back into his own corner. And look at the fans all on their feet here. You're seeing a world class main event right here. Downtown Toronto, Les Desperados in stereo. Pair of drop kicks on Alex Shelley. Gringo Loco very pleased with himself there. I don't know what Arez, uh, Arez was doing. Pick it away. The Desperados try and get that chant going. Kind of fizzled away there. Oh, no, no. Scoops up Alex Shelley to the neutral corner. Puts him right where he wants him, Chris. What's he got in mind, you think? Split-legged moonsault. You never know with Gringo Loco. Moonsault to his feet on the inside. Shelly able to roll out. Wow, classic Shelly. Face first with that SDO style maneuver in the middle buckle. Yeah, flat liner right into the second buckle. Arez desperate for the tag here. Gringo the gets the tag first though, Hutch Henry's. Cutting off Shelly, but gets the tag anyways behind the back. Here's Sabin. Constellation, Chris Saban. Hail Saban, baby. Here we go. And here's why we hail Saban. Bam, and the moves that have put them on the map. A lot of fans and pundits, journalists have been speculating the future of Motor City Machine Guns. What would it mean for Demand Lucha? 
if the Motor City Machine Guns were able to capture those tag team titles here tonight, Hutch Henry. I'll tell you, Alex Shelley would finally be happy. But and, big uh, PK big... kick and a Shining Wizard there, double combination on Erez and Chris Saban now in firm control over they... one half of the tag champs. Hutch Henry, they do talk about the open door in professional wrestling. You never know where these guys might take those Royal Canadian Tag Team Championships. Well, if anybody's gonna travel all over the world with them, it's these guys. I mean, Los Desperados well-traveled as well currently, that's for sure, but the machine guns are literally sought after. You never know where they're gonna be. Dirty tactics here in the corner, double teaming. That's what it's all about. The smart maneuvers here from the Motor City Machine Guns. They've wisely isolated Arez, the more inexperienced of the two of Los Desperados. Oh yeah. You know, actually, I guess that makes sense. Punishing. Oh, we know what's going on the here. King of Strange Style. He's gonna stomp right on. That hurts the elbow. Hyper extends the wrist. A brutal maneuver here. Bam. We all saw it coming, and Shelley made him think about it. Could dislocate that elbow there and really take Ares out of the equation here. What an incredible main event this is, Hutch Henry's. What a night it's been here at Boom Chakalucha. We'll be back in September, and only one of these teams is gonna walk out with those tag team gold. Hammerlock into the corner. Wow. Far side in there, zoning in on that arm. You can see the quick tags coming in there. Rock there again. From the Motor City Machine Guns. Shelly again pulling out the arm, and man, they are focusing right on it. And this is not the way that Los Desperados want things to go here. Well, smart to keep Gringo Loco out of the ring. You never, I mean, here in Toronto, Gringo Loco almost seems to have superpowers. I don't know what's going on, but I would not be surprised if they talked about it backstage, isolate Arez, maybe even talked about the arm. Great innovation here. Modified abdominal style stretch here from Sabin. Wrenching back almost like a modified chicken wing. Just wrenching back here on RS. You wanted strange style. Abdominal stretch, chicken wing. Hammerlock. Holding on to that arm. Oh, and right to the shoulder. More damage. And Saban with pinpoint accuracy on RS here. Champions in trouble. Obviously working away on the trapezius, but you got a lot of nerves in there. The brachial plexus, which connects the neck into the shoulder area. These guys probably know just what they're like. I'm sure Shelly, he's a chiropractor outside. He knows exactly what's going on. Alex Shelly, one of the most technical wrestlers in the history of professional wrestling. You look at this maneuver applied here now. Gringo's had enough sneaking in the ring. Brad Myers admonishing him, but obviously not enough to make the man get out. Saban following in kitchen sink. That's a big target there on Gringo Loco, and Saban hit it hard. And man, backbreaker, backstapper style maneuver there onto Arez. The Motor City machine guns are playing around. Alex Shelley called in the heavies. He called in his longest and oldest friend here, Hutch Henrys. And you can see there's no wasted movements, no wasted maneuvers for Chris Saban. Everything that he was doing was with pinpoint accuracy. Desperation from Arez. Oh, Pele kick, and he saw it coming a mile away. King of strange style, living up to the moniker, that's for sure. You can see him trying to keep that weight and that pressure off of that, off of that arm. And Shelly trying to get up, but totally jelly-legged. And there's the official tag, tag to Gringo Loco. Tag first to Gringo. Kicking him off. Oh, now we tag got Saban in there. Ah, oh, take it out, Arez. As I said, pinpoint accuracy. Look at this. Saban, just so smooth. Saban, where you been, man? Oh! Chris Saban still as quick and as accurate as ever. And you're right, Chris, seems to de-age the Benjamin Button of the independent wrestling scene and about to show us, oh, where he puts that energy. Wow. This could be it right here. Patented tag team maneuvers from the Motor City Machine Guns to, whoa. And the magic killer, not enough here. 
So many close calls. Wow, big open-handed slap there from Ares. Side of the head on Shelly. And now dig it in with a big boot to the face. Desperado is focusing on Alex Shelley here. If they're smart, they're gonna try and put Shelley away. grabbed onto the hair of Alex Shelley. You knew he wasn't going to be impressed at all. And look at that. Nobody touches Alex Shelley's hair. No, and the, now the fans firmly behind the Motor City Machine Guns. They want to see new tag champs. And i got to be honest with you, Chris, so do I. Measuring so, him. So many historic teams have held those tag team championships. I think he waited too long, Chris. I would have gone. I wouldn't have waited. I would have gone in to get him. And oh, there we go. Miscommunication. Very rare from the veteran team. I was going to say, not very often when you see something like that happen to the machine guns. Wow! Los Ares, his own partner, from a monkey flip into a pair of DDTs. Yes, Incredible. Absolutely awesome. Flipped himself right into the wheelbarrow. All the way into jumping double DDTs and in firm control here. Arez looking to get the win. No. Up and over, saving. Here's some classic Arez. Saving, Kano prepared, but fighting out. Gringo Loco getting up top. Turn saving inside out. Gringo all the way, double jump. Wow, right to the face. No, oh, it was so close. Officials here. Did, uh, our, did you see our ring guy ran over to grab the belts? He thought, to, he thought that was it. He thought that was it. It could go either way here. This has got to be one of the toughest challenges for Gringo Loco. In general, the yeah. Lucha, the Motor City Machine Guns. Saban puts the boot up, launches him out to the apron, but Los Desperados. Oh man, and now a miscommunication from the champs, almost identical to what happened earlier to the machine guns. And now in behind, no. Saban with the cutter. Look at the speed here, even after 10, 15 minutes in the match. Boom, classic machine guns. Was that a machine gun salute there from Alex Shelley to the fans of Toronto? Bam, right in the corner. It's called the Detroit Hello. They put Gringo Loco into position. Going oh. for that falling neck breaker they love to use. Gringo out, now up on the shoulders, oh, right down. Ah, oh, double stop from Ares. Saban. One, two, yes, yes, yes. Wow. Here are your winners. And still the man, Lucha, world Canadian tag team champions, the 